the one that has uh, left a lasting impression on me uh, is uh, Gayatri Devi. How can leaders today role model trust? Hello everyone, I am Nupur and I'm very excited to have Yashaswini Ramaswamy with us who is going to speak at the Leadership Summit 2023 about why trust is an integral component of leadership. Hi Yashaswini, how are you? Hi Nupur, I'm well. Uh, thank you so much for having me over to your summit. Thanks for joining us. Um, uh, Yashaswini, to know you a little better, Please share how you describe yourself in three words. Ah, uh, th these are the tricky ones. Compassionate, uh, simple, adventurous. Wow, you managed to describe exactly in three words. It's a difficult job. <laughs> so that's that's yeah. great to know about you, Yashiswini. So Yashaswini, if you were not a serial entrepreneur, what other profession would you have been chosen for yourself? Ah, uh, that's an interesting one, Nupur. I think when I was a child, I wanted to be in the army. Uh, when I grew up, I wanted to be an IS officer like my father. And uh, then, and after that, for a very long time now, I feel I would have been a very good doctor. So, you know, that's how my mind works. But if I were to really call out a profession, I think um, I would be a doctor or an author. That's what uh, is close to my heart. It's wonderful to know such diverse yeah. interests of yours. I know, tell me about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, now coming back to um, your favorite book, do you have any favorites? Please oh, yeah, tell me. Um, my favorite book uh, for, for a long time, and I think will always be, is a classic Sherlock Holmes by Arthur Conan Doyle. Uh, that's my all time favorite. Um, Ruskin Bond, um, and uh, I typically enjoy biographies, Nupur. And the one that has uh, left a lasting impression on me uh, is uh, Gayatri Devi, Maharani Gayatri Devi, The Princess Remembers. Um, I think that left. Um, and from a biography standpoint, I think the story of uh, Jai Lalita for me has been very inspiring. That, that's really interesting to know uh, this side of yours as well. So now, now coming back to your session at the Leadership Summit, Yashaswini, let's talk about why should anyone join your session at this event? Yes, uh, so why should you? I think you should, um, you should because that is going to be a conversation and a dialogue. It's not going to be a boring one-sided conversation because I've never known, um, I'm not a very big fan of one-sided conversation. So it's definitely going to be a dialogue. Uh, and what I intend to share with the audience that day is a little bit of my journey. Um, I like to keep it real. I like to keep it authentic. And uh, look, the topic is on trust, and that is so debatable because everybody has has their own uh, interpretation. So I'm certainly looking forward to it. Uh, I I hope uh, I hope all of you are too. Yeah, so are we. We are we are quite quite keen to uh, go through your session. Now, now let's talk about what are the three key takeaways you would like to highlight for, from your session, Yashaswini? Yeah, I think that's a great question, uh, Nupur. Um, I think one is, if I talk about trust, I think I'm going to be spending quite a bit of time on how, how can leaders today role model trust? How is it that you can build trust in your organizations? Um, I'll also be talking about the fundamental blocks of uh, an authentic leader 
uh, because of the global uncertainty in the economies that we're dealing with, I think the style of leadership itself that used to be practiced pre-pandemic to what is being expected of us now has changed. Uh, so I'm going to be uh, talking through that. And I think the takeaways would be, you know, uh, some do's and don'ts around how do we build trust in our workplace culture. That's great to know, Yashaswini. Thanks for joining us for this brief discussion. We are really looking forward to your session. Yeah, and thank you for the invite, Nupur. Uh, I'm certainly looking forward to it and uh, all the very best.